how do we know if TheraBreath works? Uh, the most common type of bad breath is food odors, and uh, people eat onions throughout the day. Um, so let me test my breath. We'll test it against an onion. First of all, let's see if my breath is fresh to begin with. Uh, this is an instrument called a halimeter or a halimeter. It measures bad breath in parts per billion of sulfide compounds. The machine goes from zero parts per billion up to 2,000 parts per billion. Uh, anything below 100 means my breath is fresh. If it's above 100, it means I've got a problem. It means I have bad breath and I should not be in this business. Uh, let me measure my breath. I just open my mouth. It has a vacuum. It sucks up some air. Within a few seconds, it will give me a reading. Sixty-one. So I have fresh breath. Okay. Now, let me go ahead and uh, bite it into an onion. I'll eat a little bit and then um, measure my breath and then I'll use some TheraBreath and see what it does. That's a powerful onion. That went up to 2,000. Okay, so what I will do is take some of the uh, TheraBreath mouthwash. As you can see, it's totally clear. No artificial colors or flavors. I'm going to rinse my mouth, and we'll test it. Cheers. Okay, it's coming down. The machine takes a few minutes, or actually a few minutes to get all the way down. Uh, the machine is used in clinics throughout the world. It's the, um, the gold standard in measuring bad breath. We've had uh, several machines we've used since 1993 to measure bad breath. Okay, almost down to there. Uh, one other way to measure is something called a gas chromatograph. It's a very expensive $25,000 machine uh, used, in university, used in universities. It's not as practical as the uh, a limiter, and then there's also the sniff test. If you want to test your breath at home, one way to do it is lick the back of your hand, let that dry, and smell it that way. Doing this, blowing into your hand and smelling that is a great way to smell your hand. Does not give you any indication of what your breath is. So let's see how, my, how I test my breath. Ready? Well, went from 2,000 down to about 79. So I think my breath is pretty good. Now, let's see what happens if I use another type of mouthwash. Again, we'll go back to the onion. One thousand six hundred ninety, not bad. Uh, this mouthwash, uh, slightly different, as you can see, has some artificial colors. Uh, blue is not a natural color. Cheers. As this gets back to zero. Uh, to read some of the ingredients here. Um, water, alcohol, glycerin, flavor, polysorbate 80, sodium saccharin, sodium benzoate, sildenafil chloride, benzoic acid, and blue one. <clears throat> okay. Getting down, and we're going to do the test here. Here it goes. Ready? Uh oh. Well, not as good as Therabreath, about 150 something. Sorry, blue mouthwash. Try better.